okay let us discuss the next problem so this is something related to conversion so 10.39 so we have problem number 10.39 so this says how will you convert the following so you have so let us say part a <coughs> so you have been given this compound here you have OH H and using this compound you have to convert this so you have to have here OCS3 so how will you convert this to compound how will you convert this from this to this you can ha you, ha you can have you, you use some reactions of alcohol you can think of something like O minus that can attack on CH3Br that is enough hint now you know the answer yeah <coughs> so basically if you treat this compound OH with sodium now you know if you treat with sodium you will have O minus O minus here now if you treat this with CH3Br now O minus will attack Br can act as a good leaving group so finally we will have OCS3 the desired product you will get the desired product are you getting so let me write OCS3 here are you getting or not so you will get the same compound O minus will attack and this Br will go so we will have SN2 kind of reaction here now let us discuss the next one so part B so what this says, so part B, I think you are able to see this one. So you have to take two mole of this. So you are free to take two mole of this compound. CH2Br. And this is two mole is given to you. And using this, you have to prepare this compound. This reaction looks like slightly interesting. So I have this, this, and then here I have a pH group again. So how many carbon? One, two carbon in the middle, and then pH group again. Now here I have a double bond also. So you see, it seems like like two molecules of the same compound have been dimerized, and now there is a double bond also. So this seems like dehydration of alcohol. So I can deduce, I can prepare this compound. If I do dehydration of alcohol, so let us see. So if you have OH here and hydrogen, if you do dehydration H plus heat, you will get the same compound. Are you getting or not? So if you do dehydration, now the problem is how can I make this compound? So this seems like O minus if I somehow I can use something like this <coughs> that is one side you have pH CH O and one side you have CH2 minus and this side you have pH CH O if you have pH CH O here and here you have C minus CH2 minus you will get the desired product this will react and you have to do hydrolysis also H3O plus so this means you can take Grignard reagent CH2 MZVR and if this Grignard reagent attacks you will get the alcohol you have a secondary alcohol now you have to prepare this compound and this compound using the given two mole of this compound one is easy this you can prepare simply using reacting one mole of it a magnesium so if I take one mole of this I think you are able to see so if I take one mole of this compound and treat with Mg I will get the Grignard reagent what about the second second can be done so let us say first you have this first mole you have CH2 Mg Br that we have done this one now the second mole what I can do is I can take the next mole so let us take one mole of CH2MZBR C 
सी एच टू आ बी आर वन मोल एंड इफ दिस वन मोल इज ट्रीटेड विथ ओ एच माइनस इफ आई ट्रीट वन मोल विथ ओ एच माइनस वट विल हैपन वी विल हैव सी एच टू ओ एच रिगेटिंग नाउ वट वी कैन डू इज इफ आई डू ऑक्सीडेशन ऑफ दिस कंपाउंड so that i can get aldehyde and that re uh, reagent that is required is pcc because i want to go only up to aldehydic stage that is pyridinium chlorochromate should be used as a reagent regating so if i use pcc as a reagent i will get aldehyde so you see we have <coughs> <coughs> sorry we have done this conversion so you have been given two mole of this one mole i have first prepared into alcohol and alcohol oxidized into aldehyde one from one another mole i have prepared the grignard reagent and now this grignard reagent and the aldehyde can basically form this as alcohol and now if i do dehydration i will get this desired product so let us copy this one fast and then i can go for the next reaction